Iran unveils another part of its military potential as the U.S. and Israel continue their threats against Iran's nuclear facilities. The latest item unveiled by Iran's defense minister is a smart ammunition system titled Basir. Its main objective is to enhance Iran's defense capability during military threats. The Basir is an intelligent laser targeting system that can be used in different types of munitions. For example, this cannon shell is now capable of hitting the target with greater accuracy. Iran says that only a few countries with developed military technology are capable of building such a system. Iran's defense minister Ahmad Vahidi told reporters that Basir put Iran among the five countries in the world with laser targeting technology. He said except U.S. and Russia, other countries have obtained similar systems through technology transfer. Bahidi insisted that the current project was the work of young Iranian experts in the country's defense industries and research institutions. In technology, this science and technology could be applied in gearing up all types of weapons, including artillery shells, rockets and ballistic missiles. Through obtaining such a valuable capability, our young experts have been able to open a new chapter in the field of defense technology for Iran. And this is how the system works according to Iran's defense industries. An artillery shell is fired. It then falls into an electronic cone whose center is aimed at the target marked by a separate electronic device in the hands of an operator far away from the target. And this is what happens. The ammunition generated by Basir could hit targets right in the spot. These targets may vary from bridges, tanks, air defense units, command posts and bunkers to mobile targets. Today we are capable of producing high-tech weapons which have very limited producers in the world by applying modern electronic systems. Iran has taken wide strides in designing and manufacturing different types of light, semi-heavy and heavy weapons in addition to military tools and equipment. The Islamic Republic launched an arms development program during the 1980-1988 Iraq-Iran war. The aim was to compensate for a U.S. weapons embargo. Since 1992, Iran has produced its own tanks, armored personnel carriers, missiles and fighter planes. Today, Iran is facing repeated military threats by Tel Aviv and Washington over its civilian nuclear program. Iran says that its response to any aggression would be decisive. Ami Mehdi Kazemi, Press TV, Tehran.